has this uh, 40 hertz. Just a 40 hertz note, so you can compare sealed to ported here, right? There's the excursion over here on the uh, sealed side. Here's the excursion over here on the ported side. Now, as I step it down a little bit closer to the port tune, that's tuned to 30. Um, you should see even less excursion as I drop it down. This here is 35. At 35, you can see that sub's barely moving over there as opposed to the sealed side. Because it's getting closer to the port tune. Now this is gonna be 30 right here. Now hopefully my camera can actually pick up movement and it's not because this camera shoots at 30 frames a second. But I mean, you can still kind of see how this one's blurry in the photo. That's because it's excurting quite a damn bit here. Okay, as opposed to this one that's not excurting at all. You know, and you can see, bounce my fingers off it. I mean, you can see it's definitely excurting. This one here, nothing. Okay, it's like not even moving. But when you go down to 25, now I'm below tuning, and you can see that the sealed box is really moving. I mean, we're, we're hammering over here. And this guy is just barely moving. And that's below port tune. You know, it started moving again, but it's not fully unloaded, and I just dropped five hertz below my port tune. If we drop all the way down to 20, I'm still not in jeopardy of blowing my sub because it's not really excurting that much more than the sealed box. It is a little bit more, but they're playing at the same volume here, off the same power. Everything else is equal, same same volume, air space, separate chamber, separate amps, but you can clearly see that, you know, the sub is not unloading, it's not excurting like maybe a hair more than, than the sealed side over here. And music that I play is not gonna go down to 20 anyways. Most music's gonna stop it maybe 25 if you're playing some decaf maybe a hair lower but you know as long as you're tuned down low you're tuned to 30 you're safe you know you're not you don't need a subsonic filter you know it's not magically just going to blow your subs when you get below your port tuning